Hi, my name is Vivian and now I'm back home in San Jose, California. I just spent a fantastic week, uh, one week in Ginger Hill. Actually, that's my second visit. And three years ago, uh, I found Ginger Hill just totally by accident from Airbnb and I stayed there for three days. It's just accommodation. Just uh, And then before I left, and uh, Mayumi, the founder of the farm and also, also a Japanese artist, and she said, um, please come back and stay longer. And I said, I will. And three years later, I fulfilled my promise and I came back and I did stay longer. And also, uh, I read uh, Mayumi's book and I, I opened the gate laughing. So it's her in a journey when she's in California Zen Center, how she uh, rediscovered herself and found the connection between uh, herself with the land with the earth and then she, 20 years ago she went to Hawaii and bought this uh, land and with the help of the volunteers and it converts from a uh, ranch to a um, very lush tropical farm and so now today we are actually able to enjoy all the fruits from this uh, hot labor that Mayumi and uh, her volunteers back then, they uh, put uh, um, put through all the hot labor and we're very lucky. So every day I joined um, the farm staff and uh, able to learn a lot of um, practical farming skills and techniques and um, for me, it's really eye opening because um, as a city person, always take the food for granted and never um, have this um, first hand experience to learn the very classic original way how to how to plant and how to take care of the all the foods and vegetables and how to harvest. Um, so in a farm it's all about the circle of life and so for example like in the morning we just uh plant this uh a lettuce and then uh our cook carolina at the same time is already came here to uh harvest the the lettuce that is ready to harvest and then uh, during the lunch it's already on our dinner table so so then when you enjoy those food and all the food they have diff different meaning immediately um, because it's actually it's the labor of the love and you just witness how it's planted how to grow and how it's thriving in the end uh, as offering it's on the table um, so we really appreciate uh, this kind of um, experience so and also not only we did uh, all sorts of the farming work and also uh, living in the farm have ex experience to to really be a big islander and uh, to see the beautiful uh the, the nature and all the activities that hawaiian big island can offer so i remember that i I, I'm, I'm so lucky able to see the most beautiful sunrise uh, in Mauna Kea. Then we got up at 2.30 and then arrived at the summit around 5.30 and 15 minutes later and the sun rose uh, above the, 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 the sea of the clouds. And it's just breathtaking and we brought the offering from the farm and some fruits and some leaves and uh, just offer this offering to the uh, Palais, the goddess of the volcano. And it's a very spiritual experience as well. And you're just like so awed by the nature and then just learn how to be humble and how to appreciate. And also I was very lucky to see the most, actually to see another most beautiful sunset in Hawaii um in ginger hill farm as well and each month they have this uh, full moon dance uh it's on the law facing the pacific and or uh, we we just dance as uh as if nobody's watching and then with the 
just uh, witness and then the, the end of the day. And so with the one of the most beautiful sunrise and one of the most beautiful sunset that just within a week, um, it's, 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 it's all about circle and the circle of life. Um, so yeah, I, I just, um, in my, I, I bring my full luggage and then actually my luggage bag is more than full and I'm still digesting um, every day that I spend there. And I really uh, recommend people, whatever you're looking for, like spiritual experience or practical or knowledge, and or even just relax, just to enjoy the beautiful uh, uh, scenery of Hawaii and to enjoy the hospitality. And that's the place to go. Um, you will come back, become a little bit different person.